Jen and Mike here just got into Universal Studios Hollywood. Mike was lightning fast and he was able to grab a virtual queue entry spot for Super Nintendo World. Um, the, the virtual queue doesn't always apply on days that are busy um, and they will have people um, come through and you have to book it through the Universal Studios Hollywood app. But the beauty about this virtual queue versus the one that's in Disneyland is, or Disney World is that they will refill it um, depending on capacity. So, you know, with a ride like Cosmic Rewind or something like that, once you miss the 7 a.m., you're pretty much host for the rest of the day. But here, they do give you continuous time to check back in. So as I was going through security, Mike was able to tap really fast and uh, yeah, we were able to grab a spot. So last time we were here, it was absolutely pouring. So, um, and it was during more of a technical rehearsal period. So hopefully, this time they'll have worked out some of the kinks, everything else. So we'll, we'll check it out. We'll let you know. And we're back. Woo, this is super exciting. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. And it's way better this time. And it's not pouring Ray like last time. Thank you, Jay. Hollywood app within the apps there's a Super Nintendo World app where you can collect stickers and badges we actually got quite a few last time when we were here during the technical re rehearsal but today we're gonna try to get some more we did manage to ride Mario Kart twice last time so Mike was able to grab a lot of the Koopa badges which is really impressive so, so of course these are the key challenges are you? I think we showed last in line. time the, the Koopa where you have to like crank the wheel to make make him fall down. No, here comes the Goomba. And here's another key challenge. This one's actually pretty tough. I think this one is a time challenge where you have to hit uh, the clocks to make them turn colors. And when they synchronize um, in the, the right sequence, the pir piranha, the piranha flower will uh, go to sleep. So once that happens, nope, there he is. He's, he's sleeping. That's how you get the and the third key, I think it's back there, which we'll walk over there in a little bit. That one is kind of a timing game where you have to hit a um, hit a, hit a button, I guess, uh, maybe like a drum button uh, at a certain time to pop something up. Once that thing pops up and it at the right time, that's when you complete the third key. So in order to get 
to get to uh, Bowser Jr. Challenge, you have to complete three keys. Um, I actually have one key left over from last time, so I only have to do two more in order to get to the Bowser Challenge. But Mike is starting from scratch. Because um, for some reason, he had to uh, resync his power up band. But this is what mine looks like. And Mike's is looking like. Yoshi! He's very good. Look who showed up. up your game because Peach looks pretty awesome. because he's, he's team Yoshi. Yoshi is a team one the last hour, so he was actually able to get one more stamp than me. So Peach, team Peach, let's go, let's do this. Just met Mario and Luigi, they were awesome. So we're gonna do some merch. Yes, there is a pair of ears that I'm currently eyeing. And uh, see if I can find them. Oh, little Bomba Man, Bomba Man. That's cute. Oh my gosh. Well, if you're a fan of Bowser, that's uh, very Bowser esque. Oh, that is that's so cute. Oh my gosh. I don't know. Are you Team Luigi or are you Team Mario? I am. I don't know. I like Yoshi. I like Yoshi. Toast. Oh my gosh, this store just makes me so happy. But we're looking for some pair of ears, so let's see. let's see. This land is super dynamic. I mean, just the movement and the kinetic energy here is insane. I don't see the ears. 
Uh, they might. Well, there's all. There's other places to get. That's merch. true. Yes. So this is just a one-up shop in. Um, it's kind of the exit queue of the, the, uh, queue the Mario part. Yeah. yeah. So and there are other stores. There's one that's outside of your Mario Land, and there's another one that is. Yeah, there's one more that's in City Walk. So we'll see. I'm really looking forward with that pair of beers, but I think this is more geared towards Mario Kart, which is right here. <laughs> oh yeah, you can get your very own Bowser uh, lanyard. These kids hints that are interesting. Okay, this is cute. Alright, I'm still hunting for those for those super cute years, so we'll, we'll continue to look for them. Okay, so this is the, uh, the one up. Oh. Yeah, last time when we were here, not only was it raining, it was uh, unfinished, but this at night is so pretty. Oh my goodness. Yeah, unfortunately, Toadstool Cafe is fully booked for the day, so we're gonna try to catch that up again, so be sure to follow us. Um, so Mario Kart's down to an hour and 40 minutes. All right, Mario Kart's down to 100. We're down to 100, so I think we should do it. Yeah. All right, let's go. Let's go. Single rider is not available tonight due to hype and demand. So right now we're looking at about a hundred minute wait. So we'll, we'll time it and see if it's indeed that. It, it fell really quickly. It was uh, started out at 180, went down um, in you know went down by 80 minutes in the past. I want to say 20 minutes or so. So can't miss this. This is really one of the best rides ever. Yoshi. <laughs> this is a Yoshi river, oh, I think. Yeah, that was the Yeah. The egg? The egg? No. She just ran right behind there. What? There's yeah, a Yoshi? Yeah. <gasps> On the screen? There he is. There he is! Yoshi! <gasps> it's Yoshi and his friends. Oh my gosh. That is so cute. Yoshi! <laughs> Last time when we were here, obviously it was doing a tech rehearsal, so things were certainly not as finished as today. There, the screens, projections are up. You can see Yoshi and his friends kind of popping, popping up from time to time. This is really, really cute. Yeah, wow. They've done some, uh, some touching up for sure. Yeah, this is also added too. Last time they didn't have the shades, but now you have like the branded MKTV Mario Mario Kart television broadcasting station. This is really cool. Yeah, the Mario Kart queue is awesome. Just so much going on. And of course, you're sort of on the second floor now, or you can see a nice little view of all of Mario, all of the Nintendo world. There's Mario Kart. Yeah, and Bowser's lights certainly didn't light up last time. Maybe it was because it's during the day, but no, this is pretty cool. Yeah, this is 
detail here that I didn't notice before. It's the, the LED lighting that looks like fire. That's kind of that's really really cool. Now we're getting ever closer to the uh, inside of the queue, and there's King Koopa himself. Um, yeah, I just checked the wait times. Looks like it's down to 60 minutes. I suspect that something must have broken down that they might might have just fixed it because we were just standing in queue for for a little while and the queue seems to be moving a lot better now. So yeah, um, park is closing in about an hour and uh, all the other lines are everywhere else in the park has been pretty pretty light. But weirdly enough, the ride for the Simpsons ride is now 140 minutes. So apparently everybody wants to be riding that one. Uh, so the fact that that is like twice as much as um, almost three times as much as uh, Mario Kart is kind of boggling my mind at the moment. There's Yoshi again, running circles. Oh, she's, she's so cute. Okay, we're almost, almost at the big Bowser statue here. Okay. I've always found this to be pretty creepy with <laughs> Peach's picture. <laughs> like some stuffed material um, but it's, it's really really neat so hopefully we can dig up a, a better picture from last time when there wasn't house in that big big old cage okay I think we got through Bowser's laboratory or his office I suppose pretty quickly there 
now we're in the the Bumba, the Bamba room. Yeah, he's his basically his weaponry. His armory. to join the actual ride, so almost there. Anyways, that's why today I didn't do as well. Um, Mike um, got the highest score in our sort of our group here, but you know we'll come back tomorrow. Hopefully I can beat my my score. I didn't get the uh, Universal Cup today, so womp womp. That's alright. We'll we'll try it again next time. All right. Well, for somebody who didn't get a hundred coins, I didn't get three new stickers. Um, Apparently, if you hit those little tiny okay. targets consistently, um, you know, hit, hit them five times in a row, whatever, um, you uh, you get a sticker. So I, I got one of those ghosts and the little like bony fish or whatever. So yeah, all right, we're uh, ready to call it a night. Yeah, the next is actually, <laughs> yeah, it is. Um, should we obey the exit? Okay, that's true. Yeah, the park's closing. All right, so we're. Also gonna call this. <laughs> We're also gonna call this a night. Um, been a pretty fun day, so you know, be sure to follow along. We're gonna, we have a couple of pretty fun things planned tomorrow. I'm pretty sure we're coming back to uh, Mario Land to check out the day view and hopefully get um, get get reservation at uh, or get a spot or table at Hillsdale's Cafe. Um, last time we tried peaches. A cupcake and a couple other things maybe we'll try something new this time so yep um that's it for now uh we will see you soon thanks for calling on